so thank y'all. Um, so news for y'all, some of y'all may know this, but um, I'm working on a brand new country record right now. And uh, that's, I said that the other day, didn't I? And I'm actually working on two albums right now because I'm working on a new country record. And uh, at the same time, the third day, we're in the studio uh, working on a brand new worship record. So, really excited about that. It's going to be third day, unlike you've ever heard before. And I'll just kind of leave it at that. It's, it's going to be very uh, different in a good way. So, Pop? Huh? Go ahead. Hip hop? Hip hop, yes. <laughs> Yep. Rap. Yeah. Rap. Rap. Hope y'all like hip hop. Um, no, it's, uh, I don't know how to explain it. It's just very, uh, some of you might hate it, but, <laughs> but I think there's some really, really cool songs, things I'm really excited about that the Lord's given us. And uh, so I'm excited about that. It's, it's really cool to be able to, to be in, um, not necessarily in two different worlds, but in two different musical worlds in the sense that um, I was, this, we're, we're friends here, I can just kind of be open and talk open, right? And nobody's, nobody's gonna, you know, go on YouTube and talk about how bad I am, or it's not funny. <laughs> but um, it's, I was really, to be honest with you, I was a, I was a little scared. I, I knew at the, about the end of last year, maybe, maybe late fall, early winter of, of last year, end of last year, that I was going to have to kind of do these two records at the same time. And I was dreading that because I thought, not only from a time standpoint, but I thought, man, I, I'm gonna, it's going to be weird to be in two different worlds of trying to, to uh, do a country record and a worship record at the same time. But I realized it's, that it's not two different worlds. It's all God's world. You know, He created it all. And so it's really been kind of eye-opening for me, and it's been really uh, what I thought was going to be a challenge actually made is making both projects better, working on it at the same time. So it's really cool, it's exciting for me. And uh, this next song I'm gonna do for you, uh, I don't, how many of you were in Hawaii last year? I love song in Hawaii, okay. Uh, I did a couple of country songs. I don't remember if I did this one, but I always like to talk about this song because um, it's weird to talk about it because I, I tried to make it as a surprise song, one of those you hear it and you don't know what it's really about until the very end, but I have to go ahead and leave the surprise and tell you that I wrote uh, the song about my grandmother. And the, the uh, thank you, thank you. One person loves grandmothers and the rest of you are evil. I kind of get it why you didn't clap because some grannies are kind of mean. <laughs> well, it's true. My grandmother, uh, my mom's mom, she passed away about a year ago. Now, don't get me wrong, I loved her, I loved her. But we called her Screaming Granny. <laughs> Because she always was yelling at people, close that door! Just always screaming at people. So, we thought, so when we were little kids, we thought she was screaming granny. And so, this song is not about her, it's about the other guy. <laughs> screaming again, granny, I will, uh, I will write, screaming granny, uh, one day I will write a song. Don't tell my mama I said that. She was mad. <laughs> this is for the sweet baby. Uh, still, y'all trying to figure out the chords. I'm actually, I'm writing the song for Screaming Granny in my head. Screaming like, Granny! I actually record it. Remember that, it's worth all my life. It starts out. Uh, how does it start? Yes, it's true, they all say it's better to 